Hello everyone out there in YouTube land. I'm the Scent Maven. Welcome back to my channel, Shopping and Scents. So, deep breaths. It's been a long day. <clears throat> it's been a day of beauty uh, because I had to get my gray. I had to get rid of my gray. This is Garnier Nutrice in the color Goji Berry, which I've been wearing for, I think this is the fifth time I've dyed my hair this color. My nails are Wave Gel USA number 102 Sugar Plum. I am wearing a shirt from Five Below and it says on Wednesdays we wear black. This is, uh, I got a more detailed shirt that has the same saying on it. I think I wore it in my last video. What it actually has a, uh, with it, but it, <laughs> but I can't speak. But it actually has a picture of Wednesday, and that one's from Old Navy, and that was more money. This was the $5 version from Five Below, which takes me to my video today, which is a Five Below haul. Okay. It's a Five Below haul. Wow. Look, I give myself a little buffon. A Five Below haul with Christmas stuff. Christmas has landed at Five Below, hashtag not sponsored. And you know that I just went t-shirt crazy for Halloween. They had such a great selection of Halloween shirts. But then we skipped over Thanksgiving, as stores usually do. And we went straight on into Christmas. <clears throat> now, with the Halloween shirts... I had a hard time finding Halloween shirts in store, so I had ordered online. Now, I thought that was going to say, say, be the same experience with Christmas, but it was not. Uh, I should say Christmas holiday shirts. There were no Hanukkah shirts, though. They only had Christmas. They had no Kwanzaa, no Hanukkah, no New Year's. Anyway, so I bought Christmas shirts online. thinking there was going to be none in the store. And then when I got to the store, they had them all in the store, plus more stuff. <clears throat> so, I'm gonna go through what I got at the store, and then I am going to go through, I like how this color, I like the tones. Do you see the tones, the reds? That's what's the great thing about this color, is it covers brown and it really gives you a, a rich red. <clears throat> so, what did I pick up at Five Below? So, they have these great pajama pants. They have these, these flannel pajama pants, right? Now, I know you guys, some of you, you guys and gals are um, concerned about, see, sometimes they have sizes and they don't distinguish between juniors and adult sizes. And some of you guys have said that they're, even their adult sizes are too small or you're concerned about the sizes. So what they did for, and I like wearing pajamas like super huge. So they have these great flannel pajamas and they have them in like 1X, 2X, I don't know how high up they go. I got a two, uh, this is an extra, extra large because I want it to be super roomy and cozy. So I got the like the traditional green and red flannel and these are soft. Some, and they have new pants smell. Some of the flannels, I will warn you, some of the, uh, no, not flannels. Some of the Christmas pants, they have the regular plaid. They have this velour, fuzzy, soft, pants and then they have ones that are like the scratchy polyester so beware of those then i picked up this shirt was one i was on the fence about as a christmas shirt and didn't order it online and then ended up getting it in store in an extra large and it says santa's workshop it looks like an old style christmas card santa's workshop handcrafted toys I think the reason why the Halloween shirts sell more than the Christmas shirts is because some of the Halloween shirts you can wear all year. Like this shirt on Wednesdays we wear black. This, I don't even think this is considered a Halloween shirt because I would wear this every day of the year. You know, so, but Christmas shirts like with Santa Claus and stuff. They're more traditionally Christmas, so I guess you only can find them to that one time of year. Okay, so I found 
This is not online. So if you want it, do go to the store because I have a feeling that these are going to sell out. I want to see this movie. It's coming up. This is a Wonka t-shirt. So Willy Wonka is coming out in December, I believe. And I got this t-shirt. So cute. These are all extra large shirts, by the way. They did have these pajama shorts uh, in winter designs. This has got like, I don't know what that is. Is that a, it looks like, it's not a porcupine. What is that? This is extra, extra large. And these are the velour. I want to say, what's the word that's escaping me? Not a porcupine. I forget. It'll come to me. Then I got these shorts. Oh my God. So freaking adorable. These are also extra, extra large. It's a skiing. It's a skiing avocado. It's winter sports avocados. Why did they not make this design in everything? Winter avocados. Okay. Then I got one of these. <clears throat> this is the other kind of pants that they had, the, the velour type. This has different, it has like dancing Christmas trees and lattes and stuff. This I also got in a extra, extra large. Because these, I find these run small, the, the pants and stuff in five below because, you know, then I got this shirt. I should show you, I left it in the other room. I got another Woodstock shirt. So I have a Woodstock shirt that I bought in Kohl's a while ago, and it has a scene from the actual Woodstock that took place in like the 60s, 60s, 70s, whenever it took place. And then they tried to redo Woodstock in like the 90s. And it said like three more days of peace and love and whatever. And it was totally not. It was a big mess. So I had the traditional Woodstock, original Woodstock shirt. And then I saw that they had the 90s, the 90s version. Surround yourself with love. This was a, and every time you see like video of it online, it's just like a, a muddy like people fighting mess. So this is the Woodstock from the 90s, three days of peace and music. It's really supposed to say three more days of peace, music, and love because it's supposed to be a continuation. And it has the symbol of like a little bird, the peace dove on the, um, on the guitar handle there. So I could not resist, but go back to the 90s with a 90s Woodstock shirt. And then this one, I think I'm, I'm not going to wear this outside. I saw this online. I don't know why this appeals to me so much. I'm definitely a dog person, although I've had, I have had cats before in my life. <clears throat> but actually, Malcolm is my first dog. But yeah, and I do have anxiety, but they don't have social anxiety. They have every other kind of anxiety, but not social anxiety. But something about this shirt, it. I had to have it. It was just like me. So it's like a cat and he's has he's holding a heart. You can't see it because it's got this damn extra large sticker on it. He's holding a heart. Let me peel the sticker off and stick it somewhere else. If that doesn't sound right. So he's holding a heart that says social anxiety. And it's just, for some reason, I it, I feel like it's me. I feel like it's me. So, yeah, I had to get the social anxiety cat. And that's everything that I picked up in the store. Yes, I am going to do a massive graphic t-shirt declutter. It will be coming up. It's just I've been so super busy. I haven't gotten around to it yet. But we will be decluttering a huge amount of graphic tees. And they will be going to a good home. So now we're going to get into the online order <coughs> of the Christmas shirts 
that I got online. Well, they flattened them out. Now, I have a feeling, just like with the Halloween t-shirts, even though, like I said, Halloween you could kind of wear all year, but Christmas you kind of only can wear Christmas. I have a feeling that these are going to go really fast. So if you like any of these Christmas t-shirts, go peruse online, go peruse in your store before they get sold out. I know, I know, it's not even Thanksgiving yet. It's not even Halloween, and yes, we've glossed over to Christmas, but anyway. How the Grinch Stole Christmas. These are all extra large. You know they're going to run out. The first size, the first size they run out of is extra large, always. So, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, not one of my favorite movies, but I love this t-shirt. It says, Here for the Roast Beast. And then it says, stink, stank, stank. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but how the Grinch stole Christmas. I just love this because it's just so, with a pair of black leggings and some like faux Ugg boots, because I will not pay for real Ugg boots. I have the faux ones that look just like the real ones. So like with some black leggings and some faux Ugg boots, very Christmassy. And it, there. So just in case you guys are wondering if they're like real licensed t-shirts or if they're bootleg. Now for your, you Disney fans, Disney, Disney. This is going to be another one that's going to go real fast. It's um, all aboard the North Pole Express. And we have Mickey and Minnie and Pluto. So, and it's this like eggnog colored shirt. I wouldn't even say it's beige. I'm going to say it is eggnog colored. Then for you pet people, it says ho, ho, ho. And it's got like a French bulldog, a cat. I don't know, some miscellaneous dog. I don't know what kind of dog you would call that. So there's that. There are a lot of really nice um shirts they had one with uh <coughs> excuse me will ferrell as elf and it says like smiling is my favorite then they had one that said feeling frosty they had so many and i was like you know what realistically realistically <coughs> if you can't wear t-shirts to work because you have to wear business attire how many weekends are there in a month four weekends so that's eight days. I know I'm special. Eight days to wear t-shirts. So realistically, don't buy a super amount of Christmas t-shirts because you only have really eight days to wear them. Eight days. And you could wear them, I guess, in January if you really wanted to. I would continue to wear How the Grinch Stole Christmas. I would wear that into January. And this other one I'm going to show you is winter. It's winter more than it is Christmassy. So you, you could wear it into New Year's, but just keep that in mind. You only have, if you work a job with business attire, you really only have eight opportunities. So, I mean, yeah. So this one is my favorite. It's called like Disco Christmas on the uh, website. So this one has a snowman and it's, you can't really see it so well. Oh, cause he's got, he's made out of disco balls. Okay. I didn't get that at first. It says Holly Jolly. I really like this one. The colors look more vibrant on the website. And that is going to be the last shirt. So, yes. If you don't want to get overburdened with too many graphic t-shirts, keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. So, that's going to be it for this five below super Christmas haul. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. I treated myself to a day of beauty, a little just sideline thing. <clears throat> so today, my nose itches and I'm coughing and I feel like I got a hair on my nose. Today, I got up, I went to church. I started my day with blessings. I went to church. Then I had breakfast. 
then I went and I had my nails done. I got a manicure, pedicure, and eyebrow wax. And then I had lunch, and then I went and I got my hair dyed because I had a lot of grays showing up in there, a lot of grays. So I needed to pull myself together. So I got myself together. Anyway, so comment, <coughs> comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Instagram. It's Shopping Incense. I will see you all in a future video. But until then, have a blessed day, morning, blessed afternoon, blessed evening, whenever you're watching this. And until next time, goodbye, everyone out there in YouTube land.